hello guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is Kobe and this is Kitech digital now in today's video i'm going to i'm going to show you how you can be able to add custom codes to your um, wordpress website so sometimes you will have to be adding custom codes to either the header or the footer or even the body okay of your web wordpress website especially when you want to submit your um, you know your website to google and then google will ask you that you have to put some code into the header of your what of your website or sometimes you might be able you you would want to what do some few um, you know changes on your what on your website using some codes and other stuff um, I would love to show you all those um, you know places you can do it without um, necessarily um, you know um, editing the, the 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 theme or you know touching the codes in the theme okay you can do it really sometimes you even submit your um, your website to um let's say um adsense and other stuff they give you codes and then they will tell you that um you know put the codes in the body or the footer or the header of your of the website i'll show you all those places where you can be able to it you can be able to do that in just some few minutes now without wasting my time let's go so um to to be able to add you know a code on your website now, of course, Wh WordPress have a default place you can what, add codes over there. Now, if you go to Appearance over here, and then, um, you know, go to Customize. And then when you come to um, Additional CSS over here, okay, you can be able to add any CSS code that you want to what, you add on your website. So if you have any CSS code, you can add it over here, okay? But um, what if the code is not a CSS code and then you, you, you don't want to, let's say you don't, it is not about changing maybe, you know, the button size or the font, uh, you know, size and all those things. But it is about embedding a code into the header of the website and then you want to what, um, you want to find a way to, uh, to do it without going to the, um, you know, your hosting and other stuff. Now there is a way you can do it very easily. So let's go back to the dashboard. And then we are going to install a plugin okay so um, we're going to install a plugin so hover on plugins over here and then click on what add new now when you click on add new you you, you directed over here just you know search for um insert headers and footers insert headers and footers okay just search for this one and then you'll be given this code over here okay this code over here which says what wp code insert headers and footers now this code used to be for um wp begin beginners what code okay but um you know just click on it install now this is the as you can see over here for one over one million active your installations okay just click on activate to activate it and then at the moment you activate it you'll be given this um you know menu item over here which says your code snippet okay now, as you can see, this is similar to the code snippet um, uh, plugin that what we used to be, but this one have what um, different, different, different you what things that you can what you can do. Okay, so for instance, adding header and footer. Okay, so when you click over there to add add the header and footer, you can add any code um, that is supposed to be added to the header, the body, and then what, and then the footer. Okay, so if the code says that. Um, the script needs to be uh, placed on the header of the what, of your website. Just come and paste it over here, and then click on what save changes, and that is all. For instance, those of us who deal with AdSense and then you know submit your website to Google and all those things, you need to what um, verify your what your domain name by inserting some codes over here. Okay, and this is exactly the plugin that you need. This one will be able to solve your what your problem for you. Okay, and then when you go to um, code snippets also. Now you can be able to what um, you know add any code that you want to what that you want to add. Okay, so when you click on add new, you can be able to add any like you know um, whether it is um, you know a custom code for your own thing or any kind of what any kind of code that you want to what, that you want to add on your what on your website. You can search for it over here and then what you can be able to what add it um, easily. So if you want to what um, dis disable the um, you know WP admin bar you want to disable widget blocks you want to disable automatic um, you know uh, um, automatic update and other stuff you want to what disable 
also another automatic update you want to you know disable attached pages pages and all those things you can be able to what, do all these things from this slide and then you can also you know get different different codes from here okay so disable login by email disable login screen language hide login errors and all those things okay you can be able to uh, do all those things so this um plugin helps you to add different different what codes that you want to what, that you want to add to your what to your website now another plugin that you can also use specifically that does a lot of things also for you is called code snippets okay code snippets now let's hover on plugins over here and then click on add new and then search for code snippet okay so this is the plugin that i'm talking about over here this one over here okay just click on install now and then click on activate okay very good so we have what code snippets over here okay code snippet over here now just you know you can click on snippet over here or just hover on um let me see is it tools no not tools let's go to settings over here where is the code snippet yeah over here okay you can see it over here snippets okay so just um you know hover on it and then you can check all the snippets now they have um you know default snippet over there that it makes your work so easily for you okay so you can you know toggle to what activate it and dis disable it the way you want it okay so if you want to add any uh, php html or you know any kind of what code you can use this code snippet to, to add it okay so for instance if you want to add um a code that will change maybe um you know um, the button from um download now to maybe add to cut or add to cut to maybe download now you can add those code snippets using um you can add those code using this code snippet or plugin okay so just click on add new and then you know just enter your php code or html code anyhow it is okay just you know enter it over here and then give a name for what for it and then you you what you give um if you want to give a description which is not really needed tax which is not really needed and then just click on what save changes to what to save your changes okay so this is how easy for you to what, to be able to um you know add some few codes and other stuff to manipulate the um, wordpress websites for you to be able to get any kind of thing that you want to what you want to you want to get okay so for for instance if you are creating a music website you want to use lm um, 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 how do you call it you want to use um, woocommerce to create you know a music selling website okay but instead of add to cart you want to change it to what um, download now okay you can use code snippet over here to add all that code over here to be able to what to change that add to cart to, to download now okay so if you are not new on this channel you realize that i've used code snippet several times okay but then i wanted to show you how you can be able to also use um this code snippets which is header insert headers and what footers okay to also insert your what header and then footer whenever you are what um you you are asked to add some code to the what to the header and then what and then the footer okay so on this note i'm going to end over here because we learn how to what, insert headers and uh, codes into our headers and then footers and then also insert codes um you know some code snippets in all um of our what our website okay so thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye bye